They are two of boxing's most accomplished fighters. Both at one point undisputed champions, boasting decade-long reigns atop the sport and ocean apart. Now their paths finally cross on the fight game's grandest stage. At the height of his career, Roy Jones simply had no equal in the ring. A virtuoso performer so masterful, he toyed with most opponents. Roy Jones tattoos Brandon, and then Jones says, look, you want more? Okay. Disposing of them with bursts of unmatched hand speed and shocking power. Jones gets his vindication via a first round knockout. Meanwhile, across the Atlantic, a salt of the earth Welshman named Joe Galzaki was quietly but efficiently building his own legacy in the division just below Jones. And Fredo just not fast enough to deal with Galzaki's amazing speed. It all changed for Jones after shocking back to back disasters in 2004. He takes a right hand hand and a left hand, and he's been knocked out again. Leaving him to rebuild his career away from boxing spotlight before defeating Felix Trinidad in his January return to center stage. What a performance now by Jones, reaching deep. Meanwhile, the longtime hero of Wales, Kalzaki, finally convincingly earned global respect against Mikkel Kessler last year. Kalzaki stands tall and keeps throwing. Then cemented his legacy in his April U.S. debut against Bernard Hopkins. And suddenly, Kalzaki is landing his straight left right down the two. Here comes the one. Now at last, these decorated champions come together face to face. I'm the example of a true comeback. Can't nobody ever keep me down. You write that down and you book when I die. Two greats with Hall of Fame records. I have a lot of respect for Ray Jones, but it's no way he's gonna win this fight. What are you fight? I refuse to lose. It's simple as that. Two legends eager to prove themselves once more. Alzaki Jones is moments away.